Welcome back to my channel. So today we're just gonna be doing a top knot bun tutorial. Um, yes, this is all of my natural hair. I am a 4C naturalista. Hey, y'all, I'm being so rude. Thank you guys for tuning back into my channel. Like, if you click on this video to watch it, I really appreciate you. I thank you and welcome back. Um, also, please do not forget to hit the um, subscribe button and the notification bell so that you'll be notified every single time I post. So. Uh, without further ado y'all let's get right into this video so it's gonna be real basic y'all know i don't like to do no extra stuff none of that um because it's already enough so we just gonna keep it real simple today um i have a powder brush a wooden brush my edge brush my eco style 24 inch tamer and two twist irons which i might need a third one but i'll let y'all know if i had to grab a third one so first, y'all, I just want to start by brushing my hair up. Um, I know most people would say, you know, natural, you want to put something on your hair. But literally, y'all, I put stuff on my hair every single day when it's out. So I'm sure I have enough moisturizer and oil on it just for this little bun. But I'm just going to brush it all up in the desired area. I want it to be kind of tight. Um, I want it to be kind of high, so I'm going to brush it all up, and I'm going to start with my eco. I don't want to put too much because I don't want it to be, like, looking too sleek. I just want it to be kind of sleek, so I'm going to eco style it up, put a little bit more, and I'm going to go in with my brush again. Just make sure I basically got it all around the perimeter. y'all my hair is so thick but yeah so just brush it up and then I hope I'm close enough for y'all to see I'm gonna grab my 24 hour edge tamer this is like y'all and I grab like a lot cause I'm using it to mold my hair down but um this stuff works so good when i tell y'all look this stuff works so good i'm gonna come closer for y'all look y'all like it works so good but i'm gonna just do that all around the perimeter so i can be able to grab it and put it all up in a ponytail so y'all gonna be back, cause it's gonna take a lot. Y'all gonna see me struggle though. But I'm just gonna speed this part up. <laughs> All Okay, guys, so I have it pretty much in its desired position. And I'm just going to take my two twist ties and try to keep it as tight as possible while I tie it around my thick behind hair. <laughs> and I'm holding my head down to kind of help me keep the ponytail up high on top of my head and not going back. And so with the last one, I'm going to pull my hair, pretty much all of it, straight, kind of brush it out a little bit, make sure it's combed through. And then I just pull the hair, but not all the way through. So I pull it like that and let it poof, poof, poof. And literally, y'all, this is all I do. I just twist it and turn it twist it and turn it <laughs> twist it and turn it and i'm i would get a 
sometimes I put a bobby pin right here to secure it. Okay, you guys, so I'm just gonna take one of another twist tie. Um, they're just from Equate Beauty. I know I didn't show y'all. Ooh, child, it will not focus. Okay, so take another twisty because remember, I just twisted it around, grab it up top while holding the bottom, and just twist that around, trying not to mess up the top knot we already created. And literally, y'all, that's all. That's it. My thick behind hair, y'all saw it. Y'all saw it go into the um top knot bun. So from there, we're just going to um look so good too, y'all. Looks so good. From there, we're just gonna try to bring down some of my baby hairs, but honestly, y'all, they don't they be being stubborn. I mean, y'all can watch me create a few baby hairs. And this is how I create all my baby hairs, by the way. With the even. Literally, y'all. Uh, the even get me right every time. Gets me right every time. I don't like to do um, wild baby hairs, you guys. I'm not a baby hair person, cause honestly, it's it like it's hard for my baby hairs to stay all day. So I don't have time to be combing out all those edges. This one ain't even do right. And then you know they're freezing back up. I don't have time for that. So we just do a little, a little, little, little. I hope y'all can see too. I know I'm not all the way in the camera, but. And as y'all can see, this is not my good side with my baby hairs at all. I just kind of let them do what they want to do over here. But this side, I think I did pretty good on. So y'all can be the judge. I turn my brightness down just a little bit. I always said it. So, yes, you guys. I hope, I hope, I hope y'all like my top knot bun tutorial. Please let me know. Like, comment, subscribe, you know. Let me know how y'all think I did for real, for real. Um, I'm not used to these type of styles. I probably bring my little baby here over a little bit, so don't judge me on that, but I'm talking about the style, like top knot, natural, 4C, because y'all just seen a little, like this was just a piece, a smidge of my hair. But I'm gonna get into some more tutorials for y'all. I'm gonna do some um, flexi rod tutorials, some um, twist outs, braid outs, and things of that nature. Uh, hairstyles you can do with those hairstyles. With those hairstyles. Hairstyles you can do with those hairstyles. Yeah, I guess. Anyway, we're gonna get into all that. So please let me know if y'all like this video. I will be bringing you guys more natural hairstyles. So just stay tuned. Um, stay plugged in, y'all, because your girl has a lot of stuff coming. I'm just so happy, like, for everybody who has subscribed thus far, because it really means a lot, you know, for y'all to actually watch my videos, come back to watch my videos. Um, yeah, so hope you guys like this video. I really appreciate everyone for tuning in, and I will see you guys in my next video. <laughs>